Hello YouTube, I'm here with another video. As you can see, I'm at the Morris Garage and I'm about to blow your mind with an amazing car review. Guys, you know when it comes to cars, I don't do this alone. I have here with me my car guru, Desmond Mill. Bro. Hello guys. <laughs> Tell them something. Yeah, so today uh, we're at Morris Garages and uh, we'll be doing a review on the 2021 MG Aster Adas together with the electric version as well. Stay tuned guys, it's gonna be marvelous. I have noticed a huge percentage of you guys have not subscribed to my channel. Guys, what are you waiting for? Smash the subscribe button, like this video, share this video, and leave a comment in the comment section. So let me take you guys in. So guys, we have the Asta here, and then my brother here is going to take us through the car since he knows much about this car. You guys know that when it comes to cars, um, I'm zero. So, <laughs> so bro, let's go. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, uh, we're right here with the Asta uh, 2021. And let me tell you, this car is competing with the likes of um, the Kia Seltos, the Hyundai Creta, the uh, VW um, Qashqai, um, other you know compact excuses. And let me tell you, this is India's number one autonomous Aethos Level Two. That means that um, um, when when it comes to uh, technology wise, I mean, it's this car is top notch. It comes with a, um, uh, an artificial intelligence that helps you to communicate with the, the, the car and other, you know, its features and all of that. So first of all, we're going to start with the front view of the car. MG, you know, did a very good job here with the celestial, you know, um, grill here that looks quite bossy, you know, with the Morris Garages, uh, you know, label here. We also have our camera, uh, our camera that helps to the front view camera, all right, as well as the, we have the LED lamps. We have um, DRL, um, which looks quite classy. We also have our corner fog lamps with quite a sporty, you know, uh, bumper. Which well, is really good. It has a really nice um, front view. Now, if we go to the, the wheels, we have our 17 alloy wheel that is quite beautiful. It has a, a red caliber, red calibers. That's very nice. Uh, we have. A, a, a black embossed you know side mirror with our camera a 360 degrees uh view camera we have, we have our sensors here uh our chrome sensor that's quite stylish and coming to the back we have our led tail light that's really beautiful we have our adas symbol here uh well we have our wiper zs and this this is actually a scam. Why do we have two of oh, this year? <laughs> actually, this is uh, this was supposed to be, you know, the exhaust, but then uh, these are the fake ones. But we have the uh, the actual one, you know, embossed there. So yeah, it, it's, it's actually a very beautiful car, and uh, we're looking forward to see what's in there to check out the features and all of the stitching. Bro, do you know what I like about this car? Yeah. The moment you see this, you definitely know that it's from before. It's from, it's from the Queensland. <laughs> <laughs> so we're, 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 we're going to check it from inside. Uh, okay. I must tell you, I was quite surprised when I opened the uh, the interior of this car. You know, I, I least expected, you know, for a car like this, I least expected it to have such, you know, a stylish and uh, modernized, you know, uh, interior. Now, you know, the finishing here is all um, stitched, fine stitching. We have our Sangaria Red. That's the color of this car. I mean, if, you, if you're looking for other options, the, the company can as well, you know, give you other color options. We have the, the, uh, the black finishing as well. With the seat, we have our uh, adjustment panel here. I was actually expecting this to have the feature of um, a warmer, right? But unfortunately, it doesn't have 
the the the, the heated seats, you know, uh, option. But it's it's okay. I mean, for we have the climate controls here, so it actually keeps you warm in the car whenever you're driving it. Um, it's quite spacious in here for someone my size. Uh, I mean, uh, I was expecting to to get something larger, but it's it's quite spacious. It, ha it has a, it has a bigger you know pilot area. The steering wheel is quite stylish. Um, has the sporty you know uh, steering wheel, just like a German made, <laughs> fake German wheel. But of course, this this car since it's from England, uh, I'm sure they 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 made sure they they, they provided us nothing nothing but the best. Um, if you take a look at the, you know, the AC vents, it has a turbine, you know, um, AC vents. The finishing here, quite soft, hand stitched as well. Um, you know, the interior still has the Sangaria red, you know. And then, now coming to the screen, we have our 10 inch screen. This actually is beautiful because it actually looks like a tablet that you can actually take out online. That's never true. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but uh, I, I like the way it pops out, you know, uh, defining it. It ha it is, it's a 10 inch um, screen with uh, features here. We have the weather, we have the navigation. It has a Wikipedia inbuilt, so you can search for whatever information you're looking for. You, know, you have your inf infotainment system here, you have your weather updates, your navigation system, uh, and other important inf infotainment systems as well. Looking at our display, now this has a 7 inch uh, display that displays your information. Now take a look at that. As you can see, we have your MG emblem. So this actually displays the information of the car together with the fuel level uh, and other important details of the car. And we have our parking system here, our 360 degrees camera. You know, that, but the graphics is really whack. I wasn't expecting to see. Oh, nah, this is not good. This is not good at all. But it's okay, it's not bad. <laughs> considering, considering a car, I mean, a car like this, I mean, I was expecting, you know, it to have some quality graphics, but it's okay. It's, it's, it's not bad. This is the key to the MG Aster, uh, quite a sporty one, you know, I like, it's very cute. So it's actually a push to start button car. So you just, you just have to put your key there and then you start it from the side and then you're good to go. One important feature about this car is the ADAS system. Now there's a, you must, someone might think this is the Alexa version of MG, but yes, of course you are not mistaken. This is actually the Alexa version of MG. So this um, system actually helps with the communication of the car. I mean, whatever you want um, the car to do for you, you can just um, speak to this system. Can you can you imagine that she 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 keeps she keeps popping you know it's no that's that's so uncomfortable that's so creepy but then anyways so if you want to communicate to this car you just say hello Asta I'm here okay you are here all right so Asta can you tell me a joke Asta, can you tell me a joke? Pardon? <laughs> it's having problems with the with the accent, I'm sure. Hello, Asta. Yes. Asta, can you tell me a joke? My doctor said to refer to my nervous breakdown as an episode. To be honest, it seemed more like a season finale. Uh, that was a lame one <laughs> but anyway it's, a, it's actually a joke it helps you i mean after a hard day's work if you're going home you need to relax i mean you can have this system you know relax your nerves and all of that i, I, I wasn't talking to you just shut up <laughs> <laughs> what i love about this guy is a panoramic you know sunroof so um with this i'm gonna ask asta to to pull back roll back this for me in hindi ladies and gentlemen <laughs> you're going to love it hello asta Kulja Simpson. Oh my god. <laughs> yes. <laughs> this is crazy, man. <laughs> Hello, Asta. I am listening. Banuja Simpson. I think my Asta is refusing to uh, hear me out with my Hindi. So, hello, Asta. 
I am listening. Please close sunroof. All right. We're seated at the back of the of the MG Asta. It's quite spacious here. Uh, we have our uh, AC vents right here, our uh, uh, USB ports. The seats are quite comfortable. I mean, they're not quiet. They are actually very comfortable with our hand stitched, you know, armrest. Um, sorry, headrest. Uh, we have our cup holders as well. There's enough leg room. Uh, we have our panoramic sunroof here. For, for those who are going to be sitting at the back, they're going to have a, a, a great view, you know, of the of the of the stars at night and all of that. So it's it's really cool for a car like this. I love it actually. Coming to the trunk of the Asta, it's one must be wondering how we're going to open this. Uh, you just have to push this in there, and then I was actually expecting this to be remote controlled. Uh, you know. You just press the button and then it's but then it's okay uh, so we have the the, the 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 boot space here it's not quite um large but it's okay um for for a family trip you know mommy and daddy with the kids uh we have our spare time uh, you know it's accessories as well so it's really cool we have our 1.3 turbocharger engine, which actually um, ex exerts um, 140 bhp power and um, 220 torque. I mean, for, for a car like this, uh, I think the engine isn't bad compared to the, the Creta and the Seltos, which actually have quite a bigger engine than this one but it's it's okay considering the fact that it has a terrible charger what is going to boost the speed of the car uh so yeah it's pretty cool in here